Hello and thanks for tuning into our Two Minute Tuesday series. I'm Gary Jewell and today we'll be discussing the differences between fixed and variable pitch propellers. In the earliest days of aviation, pilots and engineers quickly learned that the angle or pitch of the propeller's blade had a significant effect during the stages of flight. From that, the invention of the variable pitch propeller was made. Before talking about variable pitch propellers, it's important to know what a fixed propeller is. Easily, it's exactly what it sounds like. With the fixed propeller, the angle is set or fixed at insulation and cannot be changed during the aircraft operation. A variable pitch propeller is a type of propeller that the blade can be rotated around its long axis to change the blade pitch. The adjustment is made by the pilot so the blades can be optimally angled or positioned for the phase of flight whether it be cruise, takeoff, or climb. The pilot controls the blade pitch with a blue lever called the governor. The responsibility of the governor is to govern or maintain the propeller's RPM regardless of the power setting. Well, with that being said, it is important to be gentle when adjusting the blue lever to not overstress the engine. Having a low RPM set with a high throttle can it jeopardize the longevity of your aircraft engine. Some aircraft have ground adjustable propellers. However, these are not common and are typically only found on light aircraft and micro lights. Here at Aviator Zone, we fly both fixed and variable pitch aircraft. As pilots advance in their careers, they may come across aircraft with reversible propellers. This allows the blade's pitch to be set to negative values, creating the reverse thrust for braking or going backwards without the need for an entire propeller to change the direction of its revolutions. It's important to remember that variable pitch propellers are all about efficiency. A minor adjustment of the propeller during cruise and proper leaning your engine can make a big impact on fuel consumption, saving you time and money. Have a question or suggestion for our next topic? Leave it in the comments below. And as always, thanks for tuning in.